All right, so this is my property. Anyways, you see this is locked. This is locked. Ace Hardware. And that's locked. And that's locked. No coming onto my property. Private property. Someone drove up on here. Don't know who that is. Don't even know if you can see that. But anyways. Oh, lovely neighbors. Uh, someone ran over my uh, reflectors. So I had some reflectors here. Somebody snatched them. It's just fucking great. But, uh, anyways. This is my property. Got some bird feed growing back there. Someone's fucking furious. Goddamn fucking furious. Oh, and you can see I keep the bitches clean. There's nothing in here. We clean up along the property. People do stuff like this. Good woods back here. It's raining right now, but someone's been sneaking over here with some Bud Light. More stuff to pick up. Anyways, we'll get this here on another trip. But, yeah, people just got to learn not to trespass on property and destroy things. Good old boys, if they're Bud Light littering and destroying the United States and all its property... Uh, this right here is the edge of my property, back to that corner. Uh, then my neighbor, they bought this property over here. You can see the city's been out here mowing. They kerf the grass to the dirt. And they got over there on that side too. And it's part of the municipal whatever uh, drainage project. Trying to take care of this because they dug this ditch, but we still pick up around here. When the water gets down, I'll uh, pull the cans out from the other side. Right now, I can't climb down the edge, and I don't have a grabber. I'll go to a tool place and see if I can get one of those grabbers uh, for reach now. But that's my neighbor. He's got some of the same problems, Gatorade. And there's a glass bud light over there. So, whoever it is, uh, they're hanging out where you can see these mud marks. Anyways. This is Inglewood, and that's Albemarle over there. But, uh, yeah, Bud Light over there, and a Gatorade, some other stuff. Uh, this is a cool guy from Texas. I mean, I would really love to have had more time hanging out with him. Uh, I think he was an electrician originally also. Former union. Up to some stuff back there. Looks like he's splitting and making his own firewood. Uh, when uh, you get some years on you, it's perfectly fine to uh, use a hydraulic uh, wood splitter. I kind of like the classic feel. I've got a couple of wedges and stuff for splitting wood with the hammer back of the uh, axe. Uh, this pine stuff, that sap can be really hard. 
Ah, to break. Anyways, Englewood 4400, Album All 4400. That's all me over there. Just about uh, two acres. The neighbor who's renting is doing a better job than the original uh, owner who moved out. The owner's vehicle always covered the sidewalk, so his tenants are better people than him. It's like, why would you block? Like the city needs to clean up this sidewalk. It's got grass growing out of it. I honestly don't mind it, but just kind of a thing. You can't see there's a sidewalk because dirt's growing over it. All right, all right. Just sticking out beyond the fence line, but that's not so bad. All that really matters is a wheelchair or a bicycle. Uh, I can get by. It's my mom over there. Wow. See. Oh, there. Hey there. <laughs> so, anyways, this is my property. You can see it over here. This is all citrus and palm trees and muscadine grapes. I'm native to Florida, the muscadine grapes. Private property. Wow. Checking the mail here at this box. It's three entrances. The next box. And uh, just making sure everything's locked and not messed with. Y'all have a good day.